guys, we're not doing a uh, how to change a uh, AK-74 mag, as you guessed, because that one was a little bit sloppy. But what we are covering today is the uh, little pouch here on my hip. This one's a uh, Kydex AK-74 belt holster, mag holster, I should say, built by RKBA. Up next, we'll take it off the belt and show you what it looks like up close. Well, I put the rifle down for a second. Let's get a closer look here at these little uh, mag pouches here. As you can see here, they do come with the belt loops on the outside. They have two different size belt loops, uh, one and a half inch as well as one and three quarter inch loops are available. You can see here it's molded to fit the uh, Bulgarian, Russian type AK-74 mags. They do fit the tactical mags as well. It's a little snugger, but they, they fit Polish, several other variants as well. The East Germans fit in here just fine as well. The 45 rounders fit in there as well for those of you guys that have those. Um, so most of your AK-74 variant mags will fit. He also makes them, the guy over at RKBA, I should say, also makes these for the uh, AK-47s. But as you know, 47 mags have a little bit more variance to them, so you gotta really kinda work with them there. They're not as universal as the 74 mags. But as you can see, they lock really securely. This mag is loaded with 45 rounds. They lock securely in place so you can run around and you have these on your belt. They're not gonna fall off, anything like that. But yet, when you wanna go ahead and pull them out, they pull right out just fine. Um, obviously, the locking tab is really kind of what holds these in. As you can see right there, it's molded in. And they go back in relatively easily as well. Um, there's just not a lot of these out there for the AK-74 mags. There's a million of them out there for P mags, some for Lancers, a lot for USGI AR mags. But for the uh, AK-74 series rifles, there's just not a lot of options out there. So I figured I'd go ahead and knock out a quick review of them. Um, some things I didn't cover so far. They're available in a bunch of colors. These two are obviously black. They come in OD green, coyote tan. Um, they also have, for, if, like, if you want to do a, a special order, he can order uh, digital camo, urban, forest, uh, desert, and they also do the uh, ATAX pattern as well, for those of you guys that are familiar with that. I think you guys have seen my plate carrier that's done in ATAX. Um, $30 to $35, I'm not really sure on that, don't quote me on that, but um, the website's below, I'll also post it right here for you guys, but I'm not sure if they're actually posted on the website or not, but you obviously can just shoot him an email and he'll get you uh, quoted for however many you want. But all in all, a good little product that fits a the niche in the market that there's just not a lot available for. And they're handy if you want to go to the range and keep, carry a couple mags of beats, throw them in your back pocket. But um, as always guys, if you have any questions about these uh, mag holsters, anything else I review here on the channel, you can uh, feel free to post here in the comment section. You can also post over at my Facebook page. But uh, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and we'll see you guys in the next video.